hello everyone so today i'm gonna work on this uh, animations for the special attack so here as you can see the character does this animation and when we slam the weapon on the ground the um, area of effect attack is activated magic attack is activated but if we got interrupted in the middle it will not be executed so like this see once while i'm waiting for the weapon to charge if i get hit it is disrupted if not it will execute properly so yeah and also one more thing here yeah. If my weapon is not in the hand already, if we haven't equipped the weapon, you see, character equip the weapon first and do the attack. But if I equip the weapon first and then do it, so character directly goes to perform the uh, charging and slamming ground. So yeah, that's what we are going to work on today. And as always, we are going to keep using the game playability system here uh, right before we get started let me remind you that you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done from the patron page i'll leave the link in description and also this is a part of this section rpg with game playability system so you can watch all these episodes where i explain that how I have implemented everything you see here in this project from scratch so feel free to check it out I leave the link to that also in the description okay and now let's get back to today's tutorial okay so I have imported this animation this one so I'm going to use this for the uh, magic attack basically this uh, area of effect kind of attack that I have implemented so first I'll enable for this oh, it's already enabled root motion and root lock because while my character do this I don't want the character to move so that will prevent moving okay and then let's create a montage and here i want the at this point i want to trigger the area of effect attack at this point so to communicate this into the game playability that we are using here i'll call this anim notifier trigger event with the tag area of fact well i think i have not that i have a notifier trigger yeah notifier Let's add a sub tag if I launch effect Yeah, let's just call it launch effect Act. okay and then let's go to the gameplay ability that we are handling the area of effect attack here g a a o e radio okay now here i'll use a montage and wait now not this then I'll use 
page for game event. This wait gameplay event. Okay. And then the tag is notif notifier launch event. And then I'll call this. So but at any case if the attack is interrupted. Oh, and ability is already disconnected here I'll connect this to either on completed or on interrupted okay now let's try Yeah. Wait. I still have to select. Then I had not selected it. Okay. Okay. That's not correct. What? Ah, sorry, this is not what I should have connected. I should have connected this on event received. Okay, now let's test. Yeah, that's better. But still, we have one small issue. If I press H, see, we do that even without a sword. So that may not be ideal. So I will have to make sure that character has equipped the sword before we try to attempt this. How do we do that? So let's try this here. Uh, I can Add this required now it should be either this red sword or one of the other swords I just need one of them to be equipped so how do I do this um okay Let's just go to the character. No, wait, I want to handle this inside here. So get avatar actor. Back tempo. Get ability system component. And then we can check as any matching gameplay tags. And make. I will check if I have a the red sword equipped or the sword equipped. That's all I want to know. Now, if this is true, all good, we can execute this. If not, we can try this try activate abilities by tag and here I'll pass the tag input dot equip dot weapon dot equip and then wait game play tag added okay now here we have a problem 
if the character is filled in the great sword this will be added but if the character is heard in the small sword this will be added so yeah it looks like the way that we have uh, defined our tags is the problem but anyway let's have a sequence Let's wait for both. So that we know. At least one of the uh, executing one of them so it should be enough. So let's add a do once not. Uh, but this instant uh, execution, so it's fine. Let's do this way. Okay. Now let's see. Now if I press H, you see the weapon directly goes to the hand, which is not cool. So we need some delay. seven seconds and let's see yeah that's better now if you already have the weapon at hand we don't need to check uh, we don't need to equip okay right and i think that's all i want to do for this episode so thanks for watching i'll upload the updated projects into the patreon page and if you have any questions let me know in the description below um, uh, maybe in the next episode let's uh, work on some more different types of uh, magical attacks um, oh yeah just let me know what you guys want and don't forget to like and subscribe see you in the next episode goodbye